We are at a very interesting spot right now at the Bitcoin Embassy, which is right in front of the Tel Aviv Stock Exchange. I'm here with Sarah, who is supporting the Bitcoin Embassy. Since when is the Bitcoin Embassy here? I think it's like almost five years. Okay. It was opened in 2003, late 2013. Wow, very impressive. <laughs> My guy used to be an architect's office. He decided that he's going to open a Bitcoin Embassy. And like uh, quickly, like like tons of people came here. People can come in, and there's the ambassadors, the people that are part of the place, okay, and they like contribute you? their time. Yeah, and we contribute our time, and we explain to people about Bitcoin, and we also have a very like a lively community mm -hmm. life. Like you know, we can talk with people in real life about Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies and politics and uh, what's going on. I'm Itai. So Itai, since when are you into Bitcoin? אוקיי, okay, מה? ממתי אתה אוהב ביטקוין? Uh, לפני שנה וחצי. ובעצם uh, מההתחלה לא שכרתי הרבה בביטקוין. Mm -hmm. בעצם חשבתי שאני כבר איחרתי mm -hmm. לרכבת. אז בגלל זה אני חושבת על ביטקוין, כי הוא חשב שהוא חשב את הטרן. אה, באמת? כן, מההתחלה. אני קניתי בביטקוין אתריום ודאש. שהם עלו בערך 7 דולר. נכון, אבל אני מכרתי את האיתריום ודאש, ממש שהם היו בערך 30 דולר היה האיתריום, כי חשבתי זה כבר הרבה. You sold it. We took it. Really? Oh, okay. yeah, like Ethereum, <laughs> לא, בדיוק אחרי חודש, איתרם עולה ל-300. Yeah, after a month, it went up to 300. אז השקעתי הכל במטבע הזה. And I put everything into that coin. ואז היה לי, קניתי 60 אלף מטבעות כאלו. Mm -hmm. And about 60,000 of that coin. ושזה okay. עלה בעצם ל... What is the name of this coin? CPC, Capricorn. Capricorn, okay. okay. ואז ברגע שהמטבע עלה ל-255, מכרתי את ה-60 אלף. So when it got to... Uh, $255, to, to $255, he sold all of it. Uh, now you don't own any of no. it? No, and then I bought it back. And then I bought it back. How much? At 80 cents. He bought it at first at 10 cents? Yeah. Then he sold it at... Wait, so how much money did you make? Wait. Yes. So he bought it at 10 cents. Yes. He sold it at 250 dollars. Yeah. And then he bought it back at 80 cents. Yes. Very good. There's also an ATM here. Okay. So what you do is this is scanning your QR code. What is the commission? They take five percent. Okay. And in the last few months, with the big craze, it was like there was hundreds of people here every day. And the place Hundreds like couldn't take it, it's a small place. And it was like really nuts for a while, and now it's like really, really quiet. Okay, yeah, it's the market in March, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> no, it was really crazy, fascinating to see, like we got to see the, um, you know, the bull run, like tons of people who don't know what Bitcoin is, <laughs> they want to buy it. <laughs> okay, and uh, uh, why are you a supporter of Bitcoin? What made you uh, to believe in it? Well, first of all, um, I like uh, the general idea that it's um, no reserve, it's a positive money, it's like gold. Mm -hmm. You can't print any more of it, no, it can't get corrupted by a central bank. And second of all, technology is amazing and powerful. So like you have the like ideological or like the sensible money, and at the same time you have a stronger technology, so it's like a win-win. 